Hey, we're going to just take a minute here and show how to properly adjust a bridle to uh, fit in a horse's mouth. I'm going to use a curb bed here. I don't think Master Shifu's ever had a curb bit in his mouth, but he likes bits, so you see him wanting to put that right in his mouth. There, good. It's okay. Pull that out and make that comfortable on him. Go ahead and hook my throat latch here and do that. But I want to adjust my bridle properly to get the most effect in the horse's mouth. And what I'd like to do is have this, this bit moved up into his mouth to where it can be snug but not tight. To where there's a little contact but not too much contact. To where it's putting pressure on his mouth all the time. Now a lot of people will say you want two wrinkles or one wrinkle or half a wrinkle or this or that. I just like to come up right to where there's contact but to where it's comfortable in him. And when he quits moving his mouth here like this, we're going to see that this is just up here to where it hits the corners of his mouth. That's about right there. The curb chain or a curb strap on here should be adjusted tight enough to where it's loose when it's, your, your bit's not being activated or pulled, but that it comes tight to where it, it has, gives pressure to the horse. I think this one right here is just a little bit tight. I'm going to loosen this up a little bit for him. Just on one side here. Good. I get a little bit of action before that comes tight. And uh, it'll be about right for what we're going to be doing riding Master Shifu here. The place where you're looking for contact is right here in the corner of your horse's mouth. Now, um, too much contact would look like this. He'd have a permanent smile and a couple of wrinkles. But not enough. He could hang down here far enough to where it bangs on his teeth. Or it makes him feel like it's almost always coming out of his mouth. So you just find a spot in here where he feels comfortable. One thing to always remember is if your horse is upset about the bit or if he's not respecting it, you have some adjustment there and you should be moving it around his mouth and finding where it works best for you and your horse.